Hello, hello, welcome everybody. How we doing? Happy Wednesday night. Whew. We're almost done with our road trip. Our real life road trip. But as you are, as you're joining in tonight, say hello. How you doing? We're live officially on Facebook, YouTube, and on Twitch. Wherever you're watching tonight, if you're watching on Facebook, hit that like button, hit that share button. Uh, go like PC and Final Score, uh, by the way, on Facebook, if you would, ever so kindly, please. We're trying to hit 900 likes on our Facebook page. We are almost there. Trying to log into uh, my restream chat here so we can get it going. There we go. There it is. And if you're joining in on Twitch, hit that follow button if you haven't already done so. We are at 28 followers. Actually, we're at 29. I didn't. I didn't update that. Hold on, just a tick. We gotta update that to make it to make it up to date. Uh, we're trying to hit the road to 50 followers. We just hit the road to, we just hit 25 followers a couple days ago, which made me super, super excited. Uh, thankful for everybody that ju uh, jumps in, follows the stream, joins the stream. And uh, we're actually doing a give it away. I'm going to be doing a giveaway later this week to celebrate the fact that we hit 25. Celebrating the fact that we hit 25. So... Gold amount, I want to hit 50. And we're at 29. Alright, that should update now. Perfect. But if you're in, say hello. How we doing, everybody? Alright, let's... Enough chit chat. We are in episode two of our NCAA basketball ten dynasty. We chose Harvard, who was eight and twenty-two last year. Harvard was eight and twenty-two last year. We had our first game a couple uh, last night. No, yesterday afternoon. Working on the road at night in a different time zone has really messed with me. Not gonna lie to you. So. I forgot what day it was for a minute. But we are run we are running into our second game. We went into Delaware and it was a really low scoring game. I was really surprised. Both teams like to play balanced offense. Uh, Delaware was playing a 1-3-1 zone and they like they did a full court trap half the time. It was a really interesting setup, and we just didn't have the shooters. We were, we shot like 20-some percent from the field. It was an ugly, ugly game to start the year. So that's where we're at with, uh, with our, our squad. We don't have a whole lot of shooters. We've only got like three or four. And one of, one of them only comes off the bench. So we've got to recruit some shooters. I don't have any recruiting points yet. Supposedly, it's supposed to happen within a week. And it has not... Uh, we haven't gotten any stuff back. So, But we're on game two. We're going to be at UC Irvine. Actually, California is one of our pipeline states. So this helps us out. Uh, trying to seek recruits from California. But we had a pretty cool, lively stream uh, yesterday afternoon, we had a few people jumping in uh, and just talking some talking some shop, talking some sports, talking uh, talking about our podcast at PCN Final Score. You'll see all the social media accounts right here next to me: Facebook, Twitch, Twitter, Instagram, YouTube, and now, as of officially today, we're on Discord. 
So if you, hopefully it should work. If you type in the command Discord, it should give you the link to go sign up and go join our Discord. Exclamation point Discord is how you do that. Uh, but it has to be through, uh, it has to be through either, it has to be through Twitch or YouTube. Facebook, unfortunately, won't let you do that. I don't think it'll let you do that. Somebody can try it. Somebody can try it. But yeah, you may be able to try it out, but we are officially now on Discord. I'm learning it, but we're, <laughs> but we're officially on Discord. All right, we don't have any recruiting points yet from our uh, Mr. Man. What's going on, man? Hey, thanks for the follow, man. I really appreciate it. You're number 30. You are number 30, which is my favorite number, by the way. 30, my favorite number. But appreciate it. How you doing tonight, man? We haven't gotten any recruiting points yet, so it's been two weeks. So let's just, we're going to play this game. We sh this should be pretty good, though. UC Irvine's a half-court team, and we are pretty even, except for our defense. Our defense is slightly better. So hopefully, we can get our first win of the season. That'd be great. This is their first, their first game. Yeah, see, we shot 21% from three and 28% from the field. Not very, not a very good start to the year. I give credit to their defense, though. I give credit to their defense. I'm holding that for too long. That's what I'm doing. I'm still trying to get the jump shooting down. It's been forever since I played this game regularly. But let's go, ESPN College Basketball. Peter Bohm is our three-point shooter. He's rated like a 76, 78 from three. We got Jeremy Lin on the squad. He's our best player. And Kenny is a super athletic guard. He's not really a great shooter. He's not really a great shooter, but he's super quick, and he can kind of shoot three. So hopefully that'll work for us. We just got to knock down shots. That's what our struggles were. Oh, Lynn lost it right away? Uh-oh, that's not good. Wow. Ooh, they're taking it to us right away. A couple more people joining on Facebook. Welcome. Hope your hope your week's going well. I'm, I'm about to finally go home for the week. I've been Oh, that's rough. Whew. Yeah, we have not been shooting well. I've been struggling from the field. There we go. Get this man rolling. We gotta get this man rolling. Damn, oh no, we can't get Lynn in foul trouble. We cannot get Lynn in foul trouble. That's our best player. So we got the sliders, we got the sliders turned up to be more difficult. And lots of fouls get called. 
Unfortunately, not all for us. Oh wow, he lost the ball, I was trying to go up for a shot. Yeah, two turnovers, not a good start. Damn. Steals and blocks have been hard to come by. I definitely did not make it easy on myself. And one. Oh, come on. See if we can't get to the line a little bit more often this game. I think we only had like two, four free throws maybe. Oh, that's way short. Damn. Split the pair. Not mad. Why are you doing that dribble move like that? So even though Jeremy Lin is super quick against the center, I can't get past him? Hmm. Can't get a, can't get a steal here. Or can't get a foul, that is. Oh, he got swatted? Oh, my God. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, this is a really a rough season. We're really struggling right here. Yeah, we're, we need a timeout. Yeah, we need a timeout. We're off to a shitty start. Super shitty start. <laughs> I'll say you better he better make that layup. I was about to be real upset. <laughs> oh, don't get that. And one. Oh, let's go. Let's go. And one. Oh, we needed that. Yes, we needed that. Oh, damn. Jeremy Lin's my second best three-point shooter. And cannot knock it down. Can't knock it down. Ooh, should have had that steal. That's off. Let's go. Oh, 
Oh, boom. No, you got to get rid of it, son. Moving screen? No. Okay. That's all right. Ooh, that should have been mine. I see the cut. I see the cut. Oh, man. Guard on guard screen. Nope. Man, Bohm is not a great dribbler. We've just figured this out tonight. That shouldn't go in. That should not go in. Oh, man. We're not getting any love right now from the CPU. And one. Oh, come on. Woo. We might have to <laughs> we might have to change this up a little bit. I mean, cuz shooting 20% back-to-back -back games teams just don't shoot like that. Especially when they're getting great shots. That wasn't a good shot, but nobody's moving. So this is rough start again for game number two. I should, I went right through his leg, like morphed through his pelvis. Man, there's no defense. It's the only thing, it's the only thing I didn't really like about this game. Oh, you got to be kidding me. The only thing I didn't like about this game is if once they throw it in the low post, it's game over. Like, he's going to make it. Like, uh, like that one. As soon as he posts up, he's going to make it. I can't make it, but the computer makes it. That's always fun. All right, we need, uh, we need some help here. We need this game to stop messing with us like this. Like this right here, that shouldn't go in. That shouldn't go in. That's a center. That's a point guard posted up on a center. That does not make any sense at all. And one. Let's go. We need that. I basically have to run. Yeah, he's two for six. That shouldn't happen. Basically just going to have to run a pick and roll all game on offense. I'm surprised they didn't call a foul on that. They've been really foul happy. can get back. How can he get back like that? I had the I had him out of position. And they uh, they let him get back on defense. Oh he got it right back. We 
We got it back. Oh, he missed it? Oh. Let's go. Offensive rebound. That's huge. Got close. Oh, wait, they called that a charge? How? Oh, my God, that was a terrible call. That was a terrible call. I have six turnovers in the fir first half of the first fucking quarter. I know they run halves. I'm just completely upset at this game right now. <laughs> This is so ridiculous. Oh. Wow. Ah, I got me some I got me some learning to do in this game apparently. Cuz this game does not like us. And he misses a wide open. Wide open 3. You have got to be kidding me. <laughs> this is rough. Oh, this is not a good start for us. How do you miss wide open shots like that? Oh, what? Ah. Uh, that, uh, yeah, that was a mistake on my end. That was. I forgot, I thought I was playing 2K for some reason. What the pass was that? How does he jump that? Oh my goodness. Yeah, I deserve that one. See, he can complete a cross-court pass like that, but we can't. That's the, that's the frustrating part right there. Computer can get away with that stuff, and we can't. I couldn't get that steal. That should have been our steal. Jump, kid. Woo, we got lucky. That was a terrible pass. Ooh, let's go. Got our first lead of the night. Yeah, we're not shooting great at all. 36% is not gonna win you a lot of ball games. Not gonna win us a lot of ball games. We're not getting much help. We're gonna be in for a dog fight on this one. We're in for a dog fight in this one. I just got to get him out of position. And one. 
Let's go. Boom. Bohm coming back in the game. You hear their coach yelling, slow down. Irvine likes to run a very slow offense. Oh, and they called the foul on the... Ooh, they called the foul. We had the position. I call it a flop. <laughs> I call it a flop. I don't think so. One of the few kids that doesn't have a name in this game. Maybe that's why. <laughs> Maybe that's why. And one again. Let's go. Count it again. Boom. Kenny's got that body control right now. And we just lost our best three-point shooter. Oh, that's off. Oh, and they call time. Chuck it across half court. Call timeout. So we don't have a run and gun team. We don't have a run and gun team. I don't even know who's Mangarelli is, the center. Uh oh. Foul on Hugh Martin. That's our worst player. That's one of our worst players playing on the floor right now. We got some foul trouble. More subs. Back in the game. We got a 26-21 lead with 146 in the half. Misses the front end. Jeremy Lin, our star player, is on the bench right now with two fouls. Controversial second foul for him. Okay, so Bohm's going to come take the... This is, this is terrible offense. I don't know what they're trying to do here. What, what was that? What was that, EA? He just threw it to nobody. That was terrible. One of the only ways you can actually play this game is you apparently cannot set an offense. Because if you do, you're screwed. Ooh, that was, okay, that was good movement. I don't know why he does that. I don't want to. Move somebody, please, thank you. Oh, he got blocked. I tried to go into him. Yeah, that was. We got it. Let's go. Boom for three. How in the hell can he not make that? He's my best three-point shooter. He's missed wide, two wide open threes. Somebody. 
Whew, we got lucky. We got lucky at the half. We got a two-point lead going into halftime. On the road at UC Irvine. Been a struggle of a first half, let me tell you. Missing wide open shots yet again for the second game in a row. We're only shooting 38%. We've got nine turnovers in this game. Nine turnovers already. Good Lord. Control the crowd. I don't think a crowd like this is going to be able to help them very much. All right, let's see our team stats from the first half. We got the rebounding advantage, and that's about it. They have three blocks. We have eight fouls already in the first half. Eight fouls in one half and nine turnovers. 25% from three. Lynn's got six points, three assists, but he's got two fouls. Ken Yee is leading the charge with eight points. Bohm has got five, but he's got three turnovers, and he's one for five from three. This guy, who is our best three-point shooter, misses two wide-open threes and is one for five from three. I don't I, Somebody would have to explain that to me. And that's another foul on Lynn. That's three already on Jeremy Lynn. He's only got two more. He's got to come to the bench already. Already. We are 15 seconds into the second half, and Jeremy Lynn is already on the bench. Boom again, no, no good. We are struggling. Oh, Lynn is not on the bench. Coach is going to run the risk, gamble, having Jeremy Lynn out there. I got to control Jeremy Lynn. I got to make sure he does not get any fouls. Jeremy Lynn for three. No, no good. So I'm guarding this guy. This is so, such a struggle because we can't hit threes to save our life. This would be a so much different ball team. Oh, let's go. This would be a so much different team if we could hit some threes shooting horribly from the field the first two games. Jeremy Lin is two for eight from the line or from the field. Only points have been coming at the line basically. That should have been a steal. Wright's got three. Two of our starters have three fouls. That's how this game's been going for us. And Wright is staying in the ball game too. Coach is being real risky right now. Two major starters in the game. And one. Oh, we got the bucket, though. At least got the bucket. 
That's what we needed. We just need the bucket. I would have taken the foul, but the bucket's good. So we got to stay control of Jeremy Lin here because he's only he's already got three fouls. Trying to set his screen. And one. Didn't get the bucket. Should have got the foul. They didn't give it to us. This is definitely a Homer. Homer refereeing crew. That should have been a steal. Oh. That was Bohm's only three-pointer. That highlight they were about to show. That's his only three-pointer. He is one for six. And he got the and one. Kenny with the foul. That's what Kenny was doing to them in the first half. Michael Hunter going for the and one. Got it, tie ball game. Oh, we got a mismatch. We got a mismatch. Oh, go the other way. What are you doing? What are you doing? Got it anyway. You see Irvine had an eight point lead at one point. Michael Hunter trying to get a, trying to bait Kenny. Good ball movement. Oh, with the stuff. Oh, and they call the foul. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? That's the second time that Ven Nest has been called for that foul. Wow, these referees are not playing with us on this road trip. These referees ain't playing with us tonight. I don't know what... Coach Campbell did to piss them off before the game. And one. Should have been a foul. Didn't get the call. Trying to get a moving screen call. with the up and under. He was double teamed, but it didn't matter. EA said it's going in. Quit dribbling more than you have to. Oh, shoot it. Let's go. Boom, finally. Gets his first three of the half. He's got to be about two for seven. Oh, get, what are you doing? Where are you going? We got this ball, let's go. Lost it. We need some motion. Lynn, wide open. Knocked it down. Let's go. Got the offensive rebound. We still can't get the board. Finally, we got the board. Oh, 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 should have had a layup. Right coming in, gotta make sure he sets that screen. Lynn gets stuffed. He got stuffed by a short point guard and it should have been a foul. EA said, 
Screw you, Harvard. We are not giving you that foul. They've been doing it all game. And they get turnaround jumpers like that. This is one of the most insane setups I have seen in this game. Completely backwards. Wide open, boom, knocks this down. Again, that is the third wide open shot he's missed tonight. That's nine points that we do not have. Surprised they didn't call a foul there. Lynn got it, boom, just gonna jack it. And he misses that too. This is insane. Got the ball, let's go. Gotta get a foul call here. Got it, was really worried they were gonna call a charge. They've done it to me before tonight. They have done it to me before tonight. Oh, that's short. Knock down the second one. We got a dog fight on our hands. Harvard's got a three point lead with just over eight minutes to go at, on the road at UC Irvine. Knocked out of bounds by Bohm. Irvine's gonna take it out the baseline. Nope. Nice move. Van Ness left his feet. Had to remember what buttons I'm supposed to be pushing here. Still can't knock one down. This is the biggest struggle I have probably ever seen in this game shooting the ball. We cannot knock down anything and they, oh, well, I was gonna say, they're knocking down turnaround challenge jumpers left and right. This has been, McNally, terrible ball handler. I don't know why I'm letting him handle the ball. Out of bounds. Got the steal, no we did not get the steal. And they get the bucket anyway. This is insane. This is insane. Boom with three. Still cannot make a damn shot from three. Mid-70s three-point shooter, best three-point shooter on the team. It does not matter. And he's had wide open shots. They get the and one. UC Irvine, Folker is going to the line for three points the hard way. The spin out of control jumper. Got it. And UC Irvine is taking the lead. 41-38. Folker knocks down. Probably the most insane, that's not who, no. There you go. Right, I don't even care who's shooting. It doesn't matter. We can't make them anyway. EA does not want us, look at this, look at this, up and under. Oh, I thought he had it. They got the offensive rebound anyway. McNally for three. He knocks it down. Harvard within one.
and they got Lynn on the foul and one for UC Irvine. The nameless player, number 33, gets the bucket. Lynn's got to have four by now. Lynn does have four. This Harvard team is in trouble. Five and a half to go. Get the other way. What are you doing? Lost it. Didn't matter. Turn around. Got it. I don't know how those go in, but wide open jumpers do not. This is crazy, crazy. And they get the touch foul. Bohm is 3 of 13 in this game. 3 of damn 13 in this game. Cannot knock anything down. Knocked down two free throws. UC Irvine's got the three-point lead. We're going to make Ken Yi handle the ball. Our center... Switek. We don't have many three-point shooters. He's definitely not one of them. But we're taking it anyway. They're sagging way off. We're going to need to get some shooters is really what this boils down to. We've got a bunch of post players out here. He just slapped the floor on him. Let's go, Ken Yi, no, does not make the three. We are shooting so horribly from three, you would think. Uh-oh, got the ball. Ken Yi, mid-range jumper, good. We have 11 turnovers, only two in this half, but you see that differential. Look at that three, that, look at that field goal percentage. Both teams shooting 30, under 40% on this game. And UC Irvine has shot, oh, what a stuff. UC Irvine has shot 20 free throws in this game. Ken Yi for three. Let's go. Harvard takes the two point lead. Just under three to go. Ken Yi's got 16. And he's the leading rebounder at a small, at a shooting guard. Jeremy Lin leading the assist with four, but he's on the bench with four fouls. He has not been a factor in this game. Speak of the devil, there he comes back in. 241, Harvard with the two point lead. This is crunch time. We gotta have guys like Lynn in the game, even with four fouls. Bohm gets the rebound. McGreary for three, no good. Van Ness with the foul, that is his fourth, even though he had good position. Ye doesn't care.
No. I tried to back down. It didn't work. We have 17 freaking fouls in this game. 17 fouls. Harvard or UC Irvine only has seven. This is insane. And they got the offensive board and get the bucket. Irvine's got the two point lead, 50 to 48. 122 to go. Lynn pick and roll. McGreary open in the corner, knocks it down. In and out, McGreary with the board. Harvard has a chance. Boom with the pump fake and the layup. Let's go. LFG, Harvard. And the foul. Thankfully, it's not on Jeremy Lin. It's on Dan McGreary. That's his first. Boom with the pretty pump fake. Takes it to the rack. Harvard's got a three-point lead with 37 and a half to go. Michael Hunter at the line. Two for two from the line in this game. Now it's a two-point lead for Harvard. Makes them both one-point lead for Harvard. 37 and go and change. Boom, across the line. Chuck it, not there. Where was the foul? Where was the foul? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, Jeremy Lin had a chance. He had the lane, didn't get the foul call, missed the bucket, rebound UC Irvine to the line for two. Folker made them both. Six seconds to go. Home for three, no good. Harvard loses a close one. 56-53 UC Irvine. Loses a close one, 56-53 on the road. Can't imagine that Coach Campbell's going to have too many nice things to say after this loss. Player of the game is Max Kenyi. He had 16 points, seven boards, a steal. Michael Hunter for UC Irvine is the player of the game there. Nine points, three boards, three assists, and two blocks. The short point guard who can't be taller than six foot. Uh, he is 5'10", and he got two blocks in this game. Their leading point getters were Eric Wise and Adam Folker. Wise had 15, Folker had 13. For Harvard, Kenyi had 16 points. Jeremy Lin had 12 and 5 assists. Bohm had 10. But the big story here, fouls and missed opportunities. Jeremy Lin was only 4 for 14 in this ball game from the field, 0 for 3 from the three-point line. Bohm was 4 of 15 from the field and 2 of 11 from 3. Not going to win many ball games when you're shooting as horribly as we have. 
We had the assist and the rebound advantage, uh, but everything else was in the favor of the Anteaters. We had 19 fouls. Yet again, we had way too many fouls in this game. We had 12 turnovers. They only had three. They got 20 free throws at the line. We shot 38% from the field. We shot 26% from three. Not going to win many ball games shooting like garbage. Not going to win many ball games when we're shooting like garbage and not getting any help. We essentially were getting zero, zero help. From the referees. Referees boned us. Not going to lie there. But we got to move on. We lost two close games on the road to start the year. Heartbreakers. Oh, I don't want to do that. I want, where's my messages? Coaching, there we go. All right, we got a recruiting message. D. Cook. Derek Cook from South Orange, New Jersey. We are highest on his list. Outside game B, passing C, 5'11", 174 point guard. Wish there was a button you could just see the messages. Trying to decide between Oregon State and Towson. Probably go with one of those two. I'm not completely ruling out some programs. Those are his top two. That is a kid from Hawaii. We're not interested in him. That's way too far for us to go scouting. Hated Central Michigan. Like there's much of a rivalry there between Michigan State and Central Michigan. Uh, another kid saying what schools he's looking at. Uh, I'm not too worried about it until we can get some recruiting points. We got zero. Like we got zero points. I don't know when we get them back. Does anybody know that? So all of our pipeline states are in the Northeast. Makes sense, because we're in Massachusetts. More messages. Couple from the athletic director. New alumni challenge. Winning the home opener is obviously a big deal to the alumni. Win, and they will upgrade one of our team facilities. Let's hope we have better luck at home than we do on the road. On the road, we have not played well. We've shot horribly. And so many fouls committed on the road. Our first home game is Saturday, the, Saturday November 28th against Bethune-Cookman. Three new recruiting messages, just schools people are looking at. Doesn't really help us until we can get some recruiting points so we can offer some scallies to some kids. I don't, I don't know how to, uh, I don't know how to get them back. <laughs> I hope I didn't blow them all. 
I, I think I blew all my points. Like, I was trying to just get... Schools kids are looking at. Not really too concerned about those. I just want to get... See, he's got us as his top offer scholarship. 